Hello everybody. Today we are playing World of Tanks. It's a new game I haven't played it before. As you can see it's battle training. So let's start. Sorry server is busy. So oh wait, we're in it. Train oil. Battle training. For the instructions to success, free complete full tutorial. Yeah, so I found this game. It's a free-to-play game. I might probably will link for download page into the description below. But I, uh, I have never played this game. I don't watch the video on it. I uh, promise you, I know the title of the game. And that is all. So, so be a uh, quite interesting experience playing something I don't know how to play and trying to instruct people on it. Here you will learn to control your tank and destroy enemy vehicles. All right, here you learn to control your tank and destroy enemy vehicles. Let's get this show on the road. Point the camera at the military vehicle next to your tank. Move the mouse left and right. The turret follows the camera as you move it. Point the camera at the ambulance next to your tank. Move to the designated location. It's a bit lagging. I might bail sorry out in a bit, but I can't put up with this. So, W-A-S-D! Like in most games. Congratulations. You've learned to control your tank. Move to the firing position. It is marked on the minimap in the bottom right corner of the screen. When crossing the swamp, note that difficult terrain reduces vehicle speed and maneuverability. Let's, let's go one graphics. Let's go on medium apply right for you much put um voice smashes this up a bit that's apply right I should get rid of a lag and it should also um make the volume a bit bad to hear so right click to suit it looks like come on let's destroy this enemy chunk destroy the enemy, enemy armor is for here. better accuracy wait for the aiming circle to shrink wait for the gun to reload enemy to armor is destroyed congratulations you've destroyed your first enemy Move to the firing Yay. position. It is marked on the mini map in the bottom right corner of the screen. Move out, Tunk. Left, 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 left. I see. Destroy the enemy vehicle. Before you fire, wait for the aiming circle to snap onto the target. We didn't penetrate their armor! Alright, come on. Wait until it gets small. Left quick! We didn't penetrate their armor! Move to a better firing position. It is always harder to penetrate frontal armor. Critical hit! Come on, ask. Drift, drift, drift in. Alright, okay now. Penetration. Enable auto aim. To avoid being an easy target, in a target real battle, acquired. you'll have to keep moving. Enable auto aim for penetration on the move. Destroy the enemy vehicle while you're on the move. You don't need to aim now. Auto aim will do the job for you. Enemy armor is hit! Drive by in a tank, doing drive by in a tank. Go bam, 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 bam. 
Hope you like. Enemy armor How do you like me now? Enemy armor is destroyed. That's Good job. Well, for what would I guess? Destroyed a heavily armored enemy vehicle. Move to the marked position and detect the enemy. Find and destroy the last enemy tank. You can only detect enemy vehicles within your view range. Aye aye, Captain. Hide in the bushes to conceal your position. Use bushes and foliage to make your tank harder to detect. Note that stationary vehicles are less visible. Use sniper mode to aim at long range targets. Destroy the enemy vehicle. To hit a moving target at long range, aim engage. at the front or ahead of the enemy tank. Auto aim is not effective at hitting moving targets target at long range. Turn it off. Penetration. I asked one hit. Waiting for load. Critical hit. Critical hit. He seems to be stationary now. He's now waiting until it gets a bit small. Come on, that's hit. a good hit. He's 39% out. Let's finish this, soldiers. Critical uh, hit. Didn't even go down. Wait for it. Boom. Penetration. 5% health. We toss in. We toss successful aiming in. Target. On the missile. Three, two, one. Enemy down. tank is down. Congratulations. You have learned to conceal your position and fire at long range targets. Training completed successfully. Training complete. Complete. Plus F1. To us, that's in game help at any time join for battle. Press escape. Back to grass, return to the grass. If your vehicle is destroyed, you receive credits and experience when the battle is over. What's the video tutorial to improve your battle performance? Let's see. Greetings, players. This short video will introduce you to the basics of the combat interface, so it will be easier to join the ranks of World of Tanks players. To orient you to the terrain, there's a mini-map located at the bottom right corner of the screen. You can see where your tank is located here, and also the allegiance of any bases. Your goal is to destroy all enemy tanks or to capture their base. In addition, you can see the positions of your allies on the map too. Their vehicles are marked with green. Remember that different vehicles are marked in different ways. A solid diamond marks light tanks. A diamond with a stripe marks medium tanks. Two stripes are for heavy tanks. A square is the mark for artillery. And a triangle marks TDs. There are 30 vehicles participating in each and every battle, 15 on each team. If you spot an enemy tank, its marker appears on the map and is shown to every player on the team that spotted the tank. Before you start a battle, you can choose the type of shells to use. There are several types of shells you can use. Armor-piercing shells are the default shell at the beginning of the battle. These are universal shells with medium penetration potential and damage. High explosive shells are selected by pressing the 3 key. If you press the button once, HE shells will be activated on the next reload. And if you press the button twice, the reload will start immediately. High explosive shells have more damage potential, but their penetration potential is poor. This means you should use them against lightly armored tanks. This indicator shows you the ammunition dispersion of your gun. If your tank is moving or turning its turret, its accuracy will decrease. The tank has to be reloaded every time you take a shot. To aim with higher accuracy, stop moving, point at the enemy, and wait until the aiming circle is ready. To guarantee that the tank will be hit, your aiming circle should be fully positioned within the chassis of the enemy tank. You can know which side you are attacked from with the indicator too. The direction from where you are attacked is marked with red. If your tank has been hit, it doesn't just affect your hit points, but it can also injure members of your crew. Use a first aid kit to cure those who are injured by the hit. Activate it, choose a member by pressing a corresponding button and cure him. Every tank has eight functional modules, which will decrease the combat effectiveness of the tank when damaged. For example, if your tank's track is damaged, it won't be able to move. The crew can repair the modules themselves, but that usually takes a few seconds, and time is critical in every battle. To repair it immediately, use the repair kit. 
Activate it by pressing a corresponding button and then press the button with the number of the module impaired. For tracks, the number is 5. Hitting the fuel tanks or the engine can cause a fire. This means the tank will constantly lose hit points and some other modules may be damaged. The crew will extinguish a fire themselves, but to fix the problem right away, you can use a fire extinguisher. For more information on key assignment, use the help function. You can do that by pressing F1, and that'll display all necessary information on the screen. The battle continues until all tanks on one team are destroyed, or any base is captured. Good luck to you in the battle! World of Tanks Wow, that was a very helpful video, if you ask me. Alright, so I think this should be the end of this video. So, tune in next time for more World of Tanks. Don't forget to subscribe. Sus subscribe. Subscribe. Uh, God, I don't know what happened then, but don't forget to. Because you don't want to miss any episodes. Don't forget to like that video. Like this video. So I know that I am doing videos that you like. And comment below if you want to play with me on this world of tanks. And I'll play with you as long as you comment below and we can work together. Until next time, soldiers. Attention!